Dear Almost Lover, I'm so tired of writing love poems, yet every time my pen touches paper, you are all that spills out of the ink. I get lost in the words I write, as if it all happened yesterday, as if our last kiss were our first kiss, and there's still many more kisses to come. But when I met with you that day to talk about us, I could see the fire spread over your eyes, the anger spread over your eyes like wildfire with every word you spoke when you told me, it's not you, it's me. So why are you still upset over us? If it wasn't you, it was me. How could you possibly feel insecure? If it wasn't you, it was all me. There's nothing you can do. And I thought to myself, why are you making him repeat himself when he obviously doesn't want you? You tell me you're done talking about this as you get in your truck and I watch you drive away, spend the rest of my day waiting for a text from you to see if you'll even ask if I'm okay. And I'm not even surprised when it never comes. I tell myself that I'm tired of writing love poems because loving you was all I ever wanted to write about until now. So I tell myself, pick your head up, it's not over yet. So this time when my pen touches paper to write another love poem, maybe I will be all that spills out of the ink. Maybe this time when I close my eyes and get lost on our memories, I'll finally accept that you and I together is just another ma memory. Maybe when I stand in front of my bathroom mirror rehearsing my grand soliloquy for you, the words I love you will no longer be directed at you but at the Reflection staring back at me. This is what you wanted, right? No more waiting around for you to change your mind and come back to me. I can take myself out on a date. When I would go to your old high school to visit my old friends, my anxiety would pound inside of me at the thought of what if he sees me here? But this time, I'll walk through those gates with my head held high thinking, I hope he sees me here this time. So there's no need to tell me you're sorry. Save your breath, just tell me you're welcome, for should you ever ask me why I never talk about us anymore, I'll finally be able to tell you the only us here now is me and myself, so thank you, dear me. I once told you that I was tired of writing love poems, because I handed my love away like candy grams on Valentine's Day. Well, I'm here now to tell you that I am in love with writing love poems, and it's not even Valentine's Day, dear me. I'm done writing about him. Let's hear a little more about you. Yeah!